Thanks, Brendan. While California officially reopened last week, that doesn't mean financial struggles have gone away for those impacted by the pandemic, especially when it comes to paying rent. 23 ABC's Brianna Willis joins us live with what some are saying will be long term consequences that may happen due to the eviction moratorium. Good evening, Brianna. Good evening, Keeley. Today, Governor Gavin Newsom announced California will pay past due rent over the last year. But one question still remains. Will California continue to ban evictions beyond June 30th? While federal eviction protections are set to expire in less than two weeks, California passed its own protections that apply to more people. The ban prohibits landlords from evicting tenants unable to pay rent due to the coronavirus. But one property owner says this ban will have lasting negative effects for those it's trying to help. Now we see the eviction moratorium of something happening, but what's going to happen next? The rents are going to go up, uh, maybe because now we have uh, big evictions or big bills on the tenants tab. Who's going to cover those rents? And if someone covers them, how fast is that going to happen? Tony Ramirez says mom and pop landlords are getting pushed out after not being able to pay their mortgage. Big corporations are swooping in and raising the, the rent for everyone regardless of how long you've been a tenant. Coming up at 6, we'll share what one Kern County organization is doing to help families pay rent. Live in Central Bakersfield, Brianna Willis, 23ABC News, connecting you.